हे माई नेम इज हैप्पी आई हेल्प कैंडिडेट्स इन डॉट नेट इंटरव्यू प्रिपरेशन आफ्टर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो यू विल बी एबल टू आंसर दिस क्वेश्चन इन एनी इंटरव्यू इफ यू हैव एनी कन्फ्यूजन इन एनी इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन दैन पोस्ट इन द कमेंट सेक्शन एंड आई विल मेक एन वीडियो ऑन इट सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद दिस क्वेश्चन बिफोर डैट आई हैव टू टेल यू समथिंग द पर्पज ऑफ माई इंटरव्यू वीडियोज इज टू गिव यू ए शॉर्ट एंड सिंपल आंसर so that you can give the same to the interviewer and will clear clear the interview therefore my answers are short and do, do not involve lots of coding so keeping that in mind let's start with the definition of the delegate so a delegate is a variable that holds the reference to a function or method or it's a pointer to a function so both these thing uh, statements are same reference to a method and pointers to a function you can you can use any one of them uh, in front of the interviewer now let's try to understand with the help of the code see here inside the program class we have two static methods one is add which is basically adding two integers and displaying them in the console window and the second method is mul which is basically multiplying the two integers now if you notice the parameters there are two parameters and the type of parameters are both same in this in both these methods and the return type is also same so one thing we can do is we can group them together and then use it so let and that how we will do we will do the we will take the help of the delegate so now this like this we can declare a delegate calculator over them so see you have this add method multiply method and we can use a calculator delegate which is you can also say wrapper over them which any client can use so you can see the number of parameters and the return type of the param uh, of the math uh, this delegate is very much similar to the number of parameters of the add and multiply method and the return type of the uh, methods so this must be same otherwise a delegate will not refer the method which do not have same signatures as of the delegate from this we can conclude that a delegate can refer to more than one methods of same written type and parameters or we can say same signature so this is the first thing now how we can consume this delegate that is inside the main method we can instantiate this calculate delegator like an uh, like you instantiate a class so we can this cal c we can use as an object so this is the in, instance of this uh, delegate and here while instantiating you can pass the method as the parameter so this is a very important thing by uh, using the delegates you can pass the method as a parameter inside the delegate and then you can call the parameters values a and b to invoke the delegate so this is how a delegate can be used in your client program so Uh, this is if the interviewer will ask you when to use the delegate what is the uh, requirement to so the very short answer is when we need to pass a method as a parameter there are requirements when we need to pass a method as a parameter now if i will go in detail then that will be a like 10 to 20 minutes long video because it is not that simple It'll, we have to use the reflection also because uh, so that is a long story but the short answer is when we need to pass a method as a parameter then we need delegate so this is what is delegate how to use delegate and when to use delegate now let me show you the same thing in the code so this is the delegate we were referring to here we have two methods here we have declared the delegate and here we are consuming the delegate so the output expected is we are passing 20 and 30 which will be plus uh, will operation it will show this output so let me show you the same in the output screen so see the expected output is 50 the sum of 20 and 30 so this is the answer of this question uh, i hope you understand the concept of delegate now if you have any queries then please let me know i will try to answer it as soon as possible